Hey, as technology accelerates, many companies are embracing what's called smart manufacturing, which is a pretty broad term, but focuses on how we're going to integrate the information technology and the capabilities of the machinery and equipment and have the plant or the production facility become smarter in terms of how it can be managed. But what happens when you have supervisors whose job it is to manage those frontline workers in the midst of all of this additional data and information? Plus, typically, you're going to have people who are continuous improvement coordinators, engineering staff, or IT people involved in accelerating the supply chain and reducing cost. So if you're a frontline supervisor and you've got all this change going on around you, you might not be able to keep up with it. And in fact, it could even appear threatening to you. Because of the threat, supervisors can get defensive or just plain not accelerate some of the changes that are happening in the facility to make the workflow better. So how will supervisors who manage frontline workers help get more rapid buy-in and results from the investments that you're making in technology and smart manufacturing in general? Well, since most supervisors and team leaders are promoted from within, they need to get on board first with the many changes that you're rolling out. And then the engineers, project managers, and continuous improvement coordinators sometimes forget that people will need to drive those systems and processes that they're uh, focused on improving. Now, interaction with the end users and their leaders is important, so those specialists that come from the front office out onto the shop floor need to spend time building relationships and integrating the relationships that the supervisor or the team leader might have with the frontline workers. So data is going to be coming at the supervisor much more plentifully than it used to, and they need to know how it needs to influence their decisions, the feedback that they give to their team, and the coaching they give to improve performance. So focus on getting the buy-in from the supervisor so that they can in turn get buy-in from the frontline workers, and that will help your company extract even more return on its investment in smart manufacturing. Everyone knows we need to change and move forward, but getting everybody on the same page is crucial to extracting the maximum profit that you can generate from those ventures. Now, once you've invested in your supervisors to help them get better at adapting smart manufacturing, you might decide to bring us in and do on-site training or send people to our public workshops, or you might want to tap into some of our products or videos that we have online that can help your team be more successful. And you can reach out to us at frontlineleadership.com or join with us in our Facebook community at Frontline Leader.